Hello my dear children. Today we are going to learn the second grammar lesson possessive adjectives and possessive pronouns. Today we are going to learn what are possessive adjectives, the form and how to use possessive adjectives in a sentence, what are possessive pronouns, the form and how to use possessive pronouns in a sentence. Let us first see what are possessive adjectives. Do you know what are adjectives? They are the words that describe nouns. Just like adjectives, possessive adjectives also describe nouns. But they say to whom something belongs. And it is also comes before a noun. Let's see the form of possessive adjectives. I have a table with two columns. In one column there are pronouns. In the other column shows the possessive adjective of the pronoun. The pronoun I, the possessive adjective is my, we, our, he, his, she, her, it, its, they, their, you, your. Okay, repeat after me. I, my, we, are, he, his, she, her, it, it's, they, their, you, your. Well done. Now let's see some examples. Imagine this girl is me. So I can say I have a bag. So simply I can say this is my bag because it belongs to me. If you have a cat, I can say, this is your cat. This is a picture of Tom and his toy car. We can say, it is his car. This is a picture of Ariel reading her favorite storybook. So you can say, it is her book. This is my dog Jackson. This is its bed. Can you see a family watching TV? They can say it is our TV. This is a photo of Jane and her parents. She is their daughter. Let us revise. When I read the question, I want you to tell the answer. The answers are shown within brackets. A. I don't like blank brother. B. She wears blank blue shoes every day. C. Blank hair is really long. D. I passed blank Math test. E. I met blank new baby sister. F. Grandmother is a good cook. Blank. Cakes are amazing. Let's see the answers. A. I don't like my brother. B. She wears her blue shoes every day. C. Your hair is really long. D. I passed my math test. E. I met his new baby sister. F. Grandmother is a good cook. Her cakes are amazing. 
Now let's see what are possessive pronouns. First, let us see what are pronouns. Pronouns are words that replace nouns. For example, Jane is eating a chocolate. You can replace the noun Jane with the word, with the pronoun she. So you can say she is eating a chocolate. Now let's see what are possessive pronouns. Possessive pronouns are pronouns that show ownership to something or someone. Like all pronouns, as I said earlier, it substitutes a noun or a noun phrase so that repetition is avoided. For example, in the phrase, these books are yours, not mine. The words yours and mine are possessive pronouns and stand for your books and my books respectively. Let's see the form of possessive pronouns. Can you see this table? It has two columns. In one column it shows the pronoun, in the other column shows the possessive pronoun. I, mine, we, ours, he, his. She, hers, it, its, they, theirs, you, yours. Let's practice. Say it with me. I, mine, we, ours, he, his, she, hers, it, it's, they, theirs, you, yours. Well done. Let's see some examples. The first sentence. This is my bicycle. You can simply say, this is mine. It replaces the noun phrase, my bicycle. That is Jane's necklace. It is hers. It replaces the words Jane's necklace. This house belongs to us. You can simply say it is ours. This is your shirt. This is yours. Let us answer some questions. Filling the blanks with the right possessive pronouns. I will read the sentence and I want you to tell the answer. A. Those toys belongs to those kids. Those toys are... B. This pen belongs to my uncle David. This pen is... C. This bag belongs to you. This bag is... D. This house belongs to our family. This house is... E. This sewing kit belongs to my mother. This sewing kit is... Okay, let's see the answers. Those toys are theirs. B. This pen is his. C. This bag is yours. D. This house is ours. E. This sewing kit is hers. Well done. Did you tell all the answers correctly? If so, very good. If you didn't, please watch the video again and try to answer the questions. Thank you for listening. See you again with another lesson.